In other news, a mother and her five-year-old son are lucky to be alive after their truck plunged into an icy river basin in western Wisconsin. Three good Samaritans rescue them. It happened last week on Highway H in Apple River, Wisconsin. That's about 15 miles east of Taylor's Falls. 19-year-old Nicole Stream and her five-month-old were in a pickup truck along with a friend when they were vehicle on the snowy road and went into a ditch. Their truck began to sink into the river basin. As Kate Raditz tells us, it was the quick thinking of strangers that saved them. The images from December 23rd of a truck trapped in icy water could have told the story of tragedy. Instead, it's one of rescue and heroism. These good Samaritans had able to intervene and get these people out of the vehicle. So that oh. was a happy ending. So it could have been, yes, it could have been very, very, very bad. Lifelong friends Thomas Cole and Sean Spafford were two of three men who found the truck along the Apple River submerged with the 19 year old, 16 year old, and five month old trapped. We heard the mom screaming, My baby's underwater, my baby's underwater. Thomas used a pocket knife to cut baby Aiden's seat belt off his car seat that was already beneath the water. Uh, he wasn't moving. I mean, he was blue as blue jeans and he wasn't moving. Together, the three men pulled him out along with the two teens. At first, the boy was unresponsive. Then that's when I bring it up on shore and started CPR. All three victims were taken to Amory Hospital. The baby boy was transferred to Children's in St. Paul. Today, we learned that the mother and son are at home and doing well. Aiden's grandmother told WCCO she hopes to meet the three men who saved her daughter and grandson.